Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski. Huge game for both teams at stake tonight with Game 3. Let's go. We are just seconds away now from puck drop. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Still looking for our first goal. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Throws it in. Nashville's got it behind the net. The Predators look to start the transition game. Pass broken up. Good stand-up hit on the play. From along the walls, they're gaining momentum. The Blues scoop it up along the boards. Puck scooped up by O'Reilly. They've got some momentum here. And he was ready for that one. Saros has the puck, and he'll wait for the faceoff. I think that's a pretty heady play. There's been a little bit of scramble around him, and he jumps on it. They can get reorganized. Saros gives his team the confidence to make creative plays, knowing he can bail them out if needed. O'Reilly's is good at taking possession from puck drops, guys. His quick draw zone ability means he can win those matchups. I'll be keeping tabs on these players all night long, and let's see if one of them can lead their team to victory. Guys, back to you. Here's a short pass to Yossi. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Sends it in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Oh, my goodness, what a stop as he flashes the leather. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. We're still scoreless. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Taken by Kairou. Nashville's got control of it now from their own end. Sends it over to Carrier. With possession along the wall. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Let's one go with the stop. The Blues gain control of the puck against the wall. St. Louis plays it up ahead. Takes a shot, and he turned that one aside. Nashville's moving it into the offensive end. The Predators have it from the corner. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. Gives him a jolt with that hit. And now it's grabbed by Tolbinen. Now that pass doesn't go. The Blues get a hold of the puck along the boards. Takes it and looks ahead. He grabs the puck here at the point. The Predators take possession in the defensive end. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Dished on over to Saad. On the attack along the boards. Cerro selects to hang on and get a whistle here, Ray. Yeah, pretty soon, James, the players in front of him are running all over the place. They're trying to help, but they're not. That cover was important. More than half the period has expired. Still no score in this one. The Predators take possession off the faceoff. The Blues gain possession along the wall. Drives it to the crease. Winds up for the point. Denies him. He got all of it. Nashville's got the puck along the boards. Into the corner of the attacking area. Let's the Lister go. And puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. My goodness, the pressure really building here in the offensive end. Janot's back in the play after getting a new stick at the bench. The Blues have it against the wall. Final minute approaching here in this opening frame. And now it's to Torpchenko. The low penalty coming up here. Quick whistle stops the play. Now you've got to really dig in. Scratch, claw, just get to the intermission, limiting the damage. The Blues will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. There's the horn, still 40 more minutes 
minutes left in regulation time. We'll get to the second period right after this. Period number two set to go here. Officials moments away from dropping the puck. The Blues go right back at it on the power play here and win the draw to start the frame. St. Louis will try to make something happen here in the offensive zone. We got a stoppage. Let's get the call. The Predators will serve two for slashing. St. Louis has lots of time for this five on three. With such a long five on three power play in front of them, they can afford to be patient. Don't take the first shot, take the best shot. Moves it quickly over to Shen, and he comes up with it. Back to the blue line. Great reflexes, another save. Oh, he's on it there. Both saves are really good ones. Sissons and company still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. From their own end, trying to kickstart this power play. To his teammate! And he takes the dish. Save me with the pad. And he came out and challenged a good save. Chenault's back out onto the ice, and they will continue to play shorthanded here. The Blues are in transition. Trenton's time is almost done. Trying to gain a step. All alone with the pass. Oh, what a stop on the breakaway. Good speed to break ahead of the pass. He thinks he's got the goalie beat, but shut down. That's a great start. And now he moves it quickly to Letty. Oh, what a stop. The Predators gain possession. Feeds it on over to Johansson. Poked away in the neutral zone by Shen. And they send it right back to him. Down the right wing and into the offensive zone. Passes the puck over to O'Reilly. The Blues will play it from the defensive zone. St. Louis gains the zone and on the attack. Nashville's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Quick feed to Johansson. Nashville's got the puck along the wall. Oh, they probably want to redo on that. The Blues scoop it up along the boards. Slides the puck across to Tarasenko. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Tries that last move. Maybe he should just shoot the puck to get deep. Got a chase now. There's a solid collision. Nashville's gained possession along the boards. The Blues have it now. Quick pass to Neighbors. Saros is going to slow things down and get a whistle. It's a good choice for him. It looked like the team had started to become unwound. Well past the midway mark of this period, we've still got zeros on the board. And from off the wing, he comes up with it with both centers scrummed up. Nashville's got it in their own zone. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Angles it over to Brown. Through center along the wing. Torpchenko's gained the line and on the attack. Moves inside! Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on that? Really sharp, never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Moves it to Saad. Couldn't make the connection on the play. The Predators moving ahead. Grabbed along the board by Sanford. Slides the puck over. Good save! He had to be quick there. I mean, that's right in the slot. Dangerous chance. And the glove gets the job done. Here in the late goings of the period, still scoreless in this one. The Blues win it in the defensive zone. Sends a pass over. 
looking to make something happen along the boards. Here's a short pass to Yossi. And now it's over to Smith. Nashville's on the attack. Snaps it on net. Save made by the goalie. That's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. And there's the horn bringing an end to period number two. Still 20 minutes more of action in the third. Stick around. anything offensively, yet here they are in a pretty decent spot. The Blues gain control of the puck against the wall. Moves it quickly over to O'Reilly. Trying to get back on the attack now. Slides it over with pace to Yossi. O'Reilly's the victim of a slash and the official caught that. We got a penalty coming up. Let's see what the officials say. Granlund's getting called for slashing. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. Doesn't matter whether you've had one or ten power plays. The fundamentals of it are the same. Win the draw, get the puck to the point, try and spread the penalty killers out. And that goes off target. So easy to save from where I'm standing, James, but that puck's got to be on the net. Test the goalie. Make them have to make the save. The Blues will play the puck from behind the net. Poked away by Yossi. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Gains the zone from the right side. Can't find his man. The Blues get a hold of the puck along the boards. Granlin's ready to go. The Blues squander a golden opportunity to take the lead here. Pass saving a beautiful. Consistency, I've seen effort, I've seen execution. They've dominated the majority of possession. They finally got rewarded to it. Puck picked up by Crew. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Quick feed to Yossi. And he takes the feed. Here's a shot. Turns it away. Quick glove hand here. He gets the glove out to make the stop. More than half the period left to play. The Blues lead it 1-0. Barbashev's won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. And the puck skips away after that move. Don't mind the idea, but it doesn't work. Now you got to chase. Moves the puck over to Granlin. Steps into the offensive end. Takes the feed. Reads it perfectly, breaking up the play. Great use of the stick at center by Saad. And he takes the pass. Poked away at center ice. Saucer feed. Big time stop there. Sends the feed in front. And the puck is snagged and covered up for a whistle. Who had the better night? Carlin, stand up. O'Reilly's worked hard, and even though he hasn't been rewarded for his efforts, I still like his game, and I think he's had the edge in our matchup tonight. Along the way, the neutral zone. Scooped up along the wall by Niederreiter. Oh, and a smart heads-up play. The Blues take it along the wall. Sends the pass in front. Another pass. 
Dismiss that chance. That cross crease pass has no chance. The goalie snuffs it out. Tobin has crossed the line and is on the attack now. Out of midair, he swats it down to the ice. A chance in front! Paddled away by Bennington. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Oh, he gets a paddle on it. What a stop by Sills. Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got it with a toe. Well, it's a good save here, James. I mean, he's got to read the play to get into position to make this stop. A difficult one from the slot. Sends it quickly for those off. The Predators really need a goal here. They pull the goal and the extra attackers out. And the home side is nervous. Look at this pressure here in the offensive end. Another shot. Big draw coming up with the extra attacker on the ice. The Predators win the faceoff. Thunderous collision along the boards. All alone! And into the empty net. That should probably do it here. I would think so, Jason. And this turned out to be a pretty good hockey game. But what's the empty net or hits? That seems to seal the deal. St. Louis is back to center ice after that empty net goal. If the goaltender pulls, they know they're going to get pushed for the equalizer, but they make a nice play and get one into the empty net. Paul Chappell's got it in the defensive end. Nice save by the goalie. Biddington's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly off top of that, James, he needed a cover there. Well, a big face-off here, Razor. Empty net, a face-off becomes critical. Officials getting ready to drop the puck to get play back underway. Browns gain possession and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. That's it, there's the final horn to close this one out. Goaltending the story tonight as they need in this series. It's about to come for everybody in front of the goalkeeper in the side for a throws a shutout on the board. And you don't have to do that offensively to beat them. And the good times are over just yet as they come back out. Hey, this is supposed to be fun. You win, the fans are having fun, you get to go and say thank you for them. That's a great night for everybody here. Well, that'll do it for tonight's postseason action, but the playoffs roll on, and we will see you at the next game. From all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski. Good night.